He's laughing. He's laughing. Say, say, come on, guys. Let's go tour my room. Whoa. Okay, so I'm taking over the video now. This is Luca's nursery tour. Um, I'm going to just go through this rather quickly because I have 22% on my battery. But we will start off with this wall. First off, we have wow. Luca's um, crib and, wow. oh my gosh, David is being so loud. And we have Luca's little canvas that his Auntie Rachie got him. Auntie Rachie and Uncle Miles got this Luca Oliver tapestry canvas, canvas thing from Etsy. Um, on the back of his door, we have this little, um, sh well, we're using it as a shoe hanger. So he has his little shoes in here. These ones I don't even think fit him anymore. But um, yeah, so I hung that on the back of the door. His laundry basket. The crib we got from Ikea. And I will link as much stuff as I can below. We got these sheets from Amazon. And we have the matching changing pad, which I will show you in a few minutes. Um, we have his hatch sound machine. He's not moving in the crib yet, so I have this here, but eventually I will move it to the opposite side of the room. And for all those concerned with safety, this blanket does not stay on the crib either for his sleep safety. The camera um, baby monitor that we have is hung up here. Um, we had another one before and it stopped working so I emailed the company actually and they sent me their newest one um, for free which was really really great but I like this monitor because it doesn't connect to Wi-Fi so no one can hack into it which I heard a lot of those stories which is really scary so we have that set up there on this wall I have this little um, hanging rack and I just put a few of um, our favorite items up there, cute, this is like one of my favorite shirts that we got him. And then we got this at our baby shower and it's one of my favorite items that he has so I wanted to see it every single day. And then just a few of his hats. Then underneath we have his books, all of his books are here. Eventually I want this to be kind of like a little reading hangout corner. And then in this basket, we have his toys in there and his stuffed animals. Then we move over here and we have the lovely window with all the blackout material. All the blackout things I could get um, for his sleep. And our rocking chair um, has come in handy um, for late night wakings and nursing and everything. This um, blanket right here, my sister knitted for him um, last Christmas. And it was before we knew that he was going to be a boy and she just felt like he was gonna be a boy. So um, she knitted that for us and we love it, it's so special. And along this wall, I'll explain this later. Along this wall, we just have these shelves hung up. We had this hung up before when this was an office and we just kept it up for Luca's room. And I just put a few of his like little toys up there. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear him out there. He is talking up a storm. Um, but I will give you a closer look of these shelves as well. And this light up here, I'm gonna show you from a different angle so I'm not getting this ugly closet in there. This lamp up here I DIY'd it's supposed to be like those prongs up there it sits on those like on a table but um, I actually wanted it to hang up here so I did a little DIY shindig and hung this up um, here is a better look at these shelves I just put a few cute books up here and my mom also got him this frame as well as the shoe rack that we have hanging on the door. These are for his monthly photos 
and um, whatever month he is, I just show that on these shelves, which is really cute. And then I have a photo of David and I when I was pregnant with him. And this little card is from one of our friends from our baby shower, and it just was really cute, so I wanted to show it. And his little humidifier, some books. And then, like I said, we have the matching um, changing pad cover. It matches the crib and his little diaper pail and a little side table for when we're sitting here or during nap time or anything. And this is where we obviously change his diapers. This is his little self-care basket is what I call it. It just has everything that I kind of use on the daily. His little snot sucker, um, his booty cream, vitamin D drops, nail file, lotion, stuff like that. And then I actually haven't um, gone through these drawers to like really organize them for this video. But he, in this top drawer, I have his diapers and wipes. These are like um, the changing pad liners, um, binkies, his little nighttime lotion, magnesium lotion. Um, and then in this drawer, I have some more like sicky items when he's sick, medicines, his hand mittens, which we barely used, little hats, some preemie outfits that I just haven't put in the box of stuff that he's not using anymore. Bibs. We have his nighttime onesies, his long sleeve onesies. And these are these are just what fits like him at the moment and then things that don't fit him yet or have already stopped fitting him go in here. Then we have his short sleeve onesies, pants and shorts. Down here, his swaddles, socks, um, washcloths, changing pad covers. And then in this one we have like upcoming clothes that will fit him. His little wrap that I used to use, rain cover. So it's not like it functions for us, but it's not like super organized and beautiful and you know, vibes and right over here my mom also got him this little picture hanger and so i hung up all photos of luca's family members since we don't live near family so as he grows up he can see his choo choo and papa abuelo abuela his tias aunts uncles cousins so we have that up for him then this closet, let's get to this closet. This is our storage. David is so loud, I gotta close this door. We have in this closet like a lot of storage and then this little section is Luca's. So we have some more clothes for him hanging up here. And then these boxes are like stuff that he is yet to grow into and then a box for stuff that he's already growing out of. And I have his little, this is like a little play pen that we just don't use yet, um, which honestly we should, but um, apart for his stroller. And then we're just not gonna talk about the rest of this closet. This rug is a washable rug from Rugs USA, and it's really great because Luna comes in here, so it's nice to just like be able to throw it in the wash. Um, and yeah, that is a very, very quick tour of Luca's room. But I hope you guys like this video. Thank you to everybody who contributed items for this room. I really love this space. It's really calming. It turned out exactly how I envisioned it to, and we just love this room. If you guys liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!